Hey everyone, it's Meg and welcome back to another Death Note reaction episode. We are on episode three and things are really spicing, heating up. We were introduced to L last time, who is Light's new rival. They want to take each other down because of their own moral codes and ideas of justice. And it's just very exciting as the audience to be watching this go down and kind of seeing it through Ryuk's eyes, who is a Shinigami, a god of death. It's wild. Um, but I'm so happy to have y'all on this journey with me and I'm so excited to keep watching. So let's get started. <laughs> I actually don't know if the blue haired guy is L because I don't know. Ooh, beautiful. The innocent and those who fear evil. I'm the one who become the god of a new He's world that everyone into desires. A villain for sure. I mean, it looks like he has blue hair, but Light doesn't have red hair. Up to this point, we've received 3,029 responses about the murders via telephone and Oh email. my god. Most of these have been curious citizens and prank calls, but there are 14 people who claim to either know Kira or who have seen him. However, nobody could provide any information that wasn't already publicly available. Mm. This week, there were an additional 21 people who called in claiming to be Kira. Hmm. <sighs> we found that all of them occurred between the hours of 4 p.m. and 2 a.m. on weekdays, local time, with 68% of them occurring between 8 p.m. and 12 a.m. So it's a kid in Weekends school. Holidays appear to be the exception it's to a kid school in school. That information is extremely relevant. Yes. Our suspect could very well be a student. Or a teacher. Mm -hmm. But someone who works in the school system. I think it's safe to assume that he's driven by a very idealistic notion of justice. So he's a kid? It's highly possible he may even aspire to be some sort of godlike figure. We're dealing with an individual he's who has a very concept out. of right. Oh! Oh my god. How embarrassing for light. Um... Well, I'm not saying this to support Kira. We've observed a dramatic decrease in the number of violent crimes committed. Oh. Hmm. Wow. So it's kind of working. Because they don't want to die by this guy's hands. <gasps> Blue hair. I'll leave it to you. Goodness. And he's not getting paid. Al is not getting paid. Well, now that I think about it, um, I'm sure everyone already knew that. It's okay, don't I be insecure. To apologize. What on earth are you talking about? Nobody said it would be easy to speak the truth, but it has to be done. Especially when it's something that isn't easy to say. Oh. So, do you think you're ready to try a few on your own now? Huh? Yeah, I guess so. That's very sweet, Light. <gasps> I don't think we've seen the dad yet. Helping your sister with her homework. You sure are relaxed. Of course. If the police try to come after me, <laughs> I'm pretty confident I've got something that'll give me the advantage. What? Hey, glad you could join us for dinner. You hungry, Dad? <gasps> yeah, it's been a long day. Are you kidding me? Oh my God. But this case I'm working on now is really tough. I see. Well, well, Daddy's a policeman. It's easy for me to hack into Dad's computer. We're on a home network, so I can copy the files I need without leaving a trace. But this means, like, I don't know, he could look and hear stuff you're saying. He could find your little setup with the Death Note. Police are already beginning to suspect a student. Hmm. <laughs> I guess that means you're in trouble. <laughs> in other words, if I write heart attack as the cause of death, then I should be able to write down all the details, including time of death but afterwards, shouldn't I? I'm interested in why he doesn't want to do other other deaths. I guess he doesn't know so much about how people could die. Um, and I guess heart attacks are just e the easiest thing to do. <laughs> definitely giving evil god vibes with that music and it's your boy it does appear less likely now that kira has a student but that's not the message he's sending by doing this but he can also determine the time of death 
This can only mean that Kira has access to police information. Oh my god. By now, he should be starting to suspect someone with connections to the police. So Kira has found a way to obtain information from the task force headquarters. Oh my god. Showing them you have connections to the police makes it easier for them to find you than when they just suspected you were a student. I love the way he flies. He's like... So I can eliminate him. How oh. are you gonna do that? Because in this world, there are very few people who actually trust each other. And it's no different for the police, you know. It's that yeah, L and the guy. investigators don't trust each other at all. Okay. Think about it. Smart, Could you trust smart, someone smart, whose smart. name and face you don't even know? Honey, what if your dad is in trouble? What if something happens to him? Oh, and red eyes, do, red that's eyes. When I'll eliminate him. Oh my god. They're both incredibly smart. It's like a game of chess. It's like a strategy game. With all due respect, Chief, <gasps> we're resigning. It's because we value our lives, sir. <gasps> if what else says is true, Kida has some ESP-like power that somehow allows him to kill people indirectly from anywhere. But then again, L never had to show his face or reveal his name for that matter. Mm. We don't hide our faces, we're out in the open. Sir. The truth is, we could be killed by Kira at any time. Yeah. Excuse us. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> In order to solve this problem, we must... <laughs> Rick, what are you doing? <laughs> I do not miss school. We brought the FBI to Japan four days ago, but said they're now gathering intel on the police. And this is the complete list? Yes. Oh. Yep, he's investigating them. The police officers and the people closest to them. We will find our suspect. Yeah, that's the pro- Oh, shoot. That's the problem. If you don't want to hear me, you can plug your ears or something. <laughs> First of all, I don't have anything against you. Yeah, he doesn't. I'm here because I have to stick around till the death note is finished, or I see you die, whichever comes first. I love his voice actor. I'm not on your side or Elle's side. Mm -hmm. Me neither. You'll never hear me say anything about whether what you're doing is right or wrong. Mm -hmm. And I'm just a spectator. That's literally us, but as the your audience. Roommate, I might have a few things to say. <laughs> <Mate. about them. laughs> you're being followed by another human. He's watching you right now. Did L already figure it out? Because he was on the chief of police page. Does this mean L is already starting to suspect the police? I don't see how they could ever figure out that I'm Kira. Uh... I shouldn't look like anything other than your average high school senior. I need my stalker's name. I bet he would hire someone to do it. I don't think it would actually be him. We are able to take human lifespans for ourselves. Wait, what do you mean by that? Let's say you have a human who is due to live until the age of 60, and a god of death wrote that this person would die at 40. 60 minus 40 equals 20. Now those 20 years taken from someone in the human world are added to that god of death's life. A god of death cannot die. Wow. Shinigami can tell what a person's name is <gasps> by just looking at their face. We know instantly. And do you have any idea why? Because through a Shinigami's eyes, a human's name can be seen above their head. Not only that, we see their lifespan as well. <gasps> and I could tell you how many years you've got left, but there's no way I'd ever tell you that. Why? I may have a big mouth, but even I wouldn't go I mean, that I far. would lose my ma mind. I would never want to know that. I would never want to know that about myself. If a Shinigami drops his death note and a human picks it up, mm -hmm. he can grant that human the eyes of a Shinigami. Oh! The price for having a Shinigami's eyes is half of that person's remaining lifespan. That's all it is. Half of my remaining lifespan. This is so chaotic. You're saying that I can't simply borrow your powers. You have to sacrifice. I have to pay for them. He's gonna die. Fast. If I agree be able to know everyone's name just by looking at them and you'll live half as long is it a deal oh my god oh my god oh oh 
was that a policeman oh that was um you know was that uh the what the younger police officer who sorry i don't know his name but the younger police officer who the chief was kind of like talking to and mentoring a little bit who said that who pointed out that there was less acts of violence since light started doing what he was doing i think it was that guy but I could be wrong. So I'm not going to think too much about that. Um, you can kind of tell, though, that he's on light side, not L's. As if, if he's following him. So maybe he figured it out. I like that they're adding even more players, like even more smart people. Even Ryuk. It's like, okay, we're, we're, we're seeing more of him because he was just kind of sitting back and, and watching. And then just now he brings up the fact that they could make this trade offer i'm curious to see though what will happen to ryuk's eyes if light is technically borrowing them like can he replicate it or would he have to like give him his eyes and then what would ryuk be seeing it's interesting and i still i'm a little i'm curious as to ryuk's intentions like is this really all just for chaos and amusement because he was saying he felt creeped out by that guy. I'm like, are is there more to him? Are there more emotions? Are there more personality traits? Like, is he developing a maybe a little bond? Or does he is he developing a kind of distaste for light? I don't know. Because all we really know is that he was bored and he is enjoying the entertainment. And what he's saying is that he doesn't want to help them. But the truth is, he doesn't want to help either of them. And he says he doesn't want to get involved. But the truth is, he can, he has been looking at light. And he knows how long he's got left. So I think there's either one of two options that are going to happen. I think either his lifespan is short. And he's kind of going the, the evil route. And it's like, his lifespan is short and it's going to be halved. And we're going to see light die this season you know and it just i don't know that's what i predict that's one option i predict and then the second would be that he's trying to help light and he sees that he has a very long lifespan and so it's more for like chaos and will he really you know make this trade just because and like maybe this will help him become the god of the new world and we'll see i don't know could be either motivation I, it seems like just with the way that he was like watching him help his little sister with homework and you know not enjoying the fact that there's someone following both of them i think he has to be at least like a little invested in light whether that's that he cares about him or just that he's invested in seeing how long this will go on and how successful light will be but kind of cool to see l taking some time and some missteps because i like that um uh, just everyone is kind of making mistakes and not going as fast as possible but uh, it's just so good it's just so so good join the patreon if you would like to watch along with me thank you so much to all my patrons everyone who's joined because of this show i am really glad to have you on this journey thank you thank you thank you and thank you to everyone who subbed and liked and commented. I love hearing your thoughts. I love going down this rabbit hole with you guys. And I really do love reading your comments. So keep them coming. And I will see you for episode four. Bye.